Welcome back, folks, to another morning in Piety, Indiana. War correspondent Ben Riley is still trying to get every survivor he can find into his fort. And today is another day. The 11th day, actually. Let's see where we stand, because this is the start of another session on Monday night, as usual. It looks like we have 90 medicine, and uh, none's currently being used, which means everyone's at full health. Which uh, can be verified, because no one is a nurse or a doctor right now. We have almost 400 food, which gives us nearly enough food for three days, which is good because the game ends sort of on the, uh, whenever you end the 14th day, if I remember correctly. Or it might actually end on the 13th day, or whenever you end the 13th day. Whatever. The point is, we don't need that much more food. And we have enough fuel for 12 days, which is just ridiculous. Also, it looks like all of our survivors are in good, good spirits, except for our four newest people. We'll teach them to be happy soon enough. Isn't that right, Ed? We'll just need to make more land sharks. All right, someone also wanted me to read David Samuelson's description down here. So I will. He's a construction worker, age 35. And he's sort of an oddball. A stranger from a faraway land, David Samuelson brings only his joy of life and a gift of fermented spirits, a technology long thought beyond his people. Samuelson was in piety spreading the word that indeed New Zealand makes a damn fine single malt whiskey when darkness fell all around him. But this did not crush his spirit. In fact, it only increased his need to spread his message among the battered survivors. So I'm not sure if this guy is some kind of developer, a friend of a developer, or some kind of contest winner. But he's a thing, as it said. Also, I did a tally of all of our uh, awesome ammo we have here. Let me go ahead and pick it up. So we have 900 rounds of 40 Smith & Wesson. We have 750 rounds of 5.56 NATO. And then we have 925 rounds of 7.62. I'm not exactly sure if this is 7.62 NATO, 3.9. I mean, it could be 3.9. It could be NATO. Both these things could be chambered for that. It's sort of weird. <laughs> but uh, it's also a thing. And we have... 525 rounds of 45 ACP. So there you go. We're doing a good job, as it were. Also, I don't think we have enough materials for another land shark, do we? There's a land shark. Now it appears that we need more of everything. I think we have the duct tape. We just need more nails. And possibly more 12 gauge. Also, before we continue, let's take a look at Ben. He's perfect at every pistol he possesses. We still need to get that elusive Desert Eagle. It's going to be sad if we don't. I'm going to be looking for it. Also, something interesting I noticed uh, off camera. Go ahead and look at Ed's stats here. 39, 36, 25, 33. And look at his skills down here. We have like 73, 53, 71. Now look at Theodosius. You'll notice that everything looks about the same, doesn't it, folks? It's identical. I think there, I think there's some kind of collision with the code here. I know it's sort of hard to believe that um, Fort Zombie has bugs and glitches, but it's a thing. <laughs> I think I've said that a few times. Anyway, let's go ahead and get rolling. Try to get this day, you know, started. We have one survivor, two guns, and one food. So, of course, we're going to try to make some new friends first. Also, folks, I'm fully aware that I'm not min-maxing this game as much as I could. I don't need to. I'm, this may be a foreign concept to you, but I'm playing this game to have fun. <laughs> Amazing, I know. But anyway, we're going to find some new mouths to feed and some new uh, stories to hear. At least that's what I hope. And maybe a Desert Eagle. That'd be nice. Come on, game. I hear you grinding over there. I know you want to load. You're spending more time because you're going to load up a Desert Eagle, right? All right, so we have some houses to the left. Some, uh... Houses to the right, we got a little encampment there. Also a place with some possible medical buffs. And I don't really need to be wasting my 45 on these guys anymore, but I'll do it anyway. Come on, everybody, let's get rolling. Our friends are down this main street here. Let's see if we can rendezvous with them first. We have a hammer time. Good work. Keep it moving. Keep it moving. Keep my eyes open for that gold-trimmed house, folks. You will know it when you see it. It's very easy to spot. Also, I'm fully aware it has vending machines in back. Believe me, the gold-trimmed gold trim is an easier giveaway than the vending machines. 
Because you can see the gold trim from the front. It's amazing. You can actually see it from all angles. Also, I see a police officer. That is a bit of a concern. Yep, there he is. Everyone... <laughs> Dumbass. Good shooting, everybody. Crisis averted. Oh, the... The zombies are just so, so majestic, so agile, so nimble. So dumb. Everyone sit tight. Let me see if I can get a coin. Can I possibly get a coin on the 11th day? The game is currently in stingy mode. So, it's possible. It's just not as probable as it once was. The game has three stages. It has the early game where you find lots of stuff, but it's usually, like, crappy stuff. Like, you find pistols instead of assault weapons. And then mid-game you find the really good stuff in huge amounts, and then around the end-game everything starts to kind of dry up. Alright guys, you can open fire. <laughs> I like how the zombies like stop as soon as- Whoa! As soon as I change their firing mode. There you go. You're in danger, I saved you. Let's rock and roll, folks. Looks like our team may actually- I don't know where the hell they are. Are they in the haymakers? Or are they in the car lot? It is possible they could be in the car lot. I don't think I've ever seen anyone in the Haymakers, so they must be over there. Well, let's go check it out. We just ran past this place, but I didn't see anybody. Oh, yeah, there's tons. Yep, there's a guy inside. I see a dude. Let's go see if he's worth any, uh... If he's worth the time to pull him out there. He probably is. All right, everyone open fire. Have your fun. That's a big one. That's a big one. There you go. Get away from Virginia. Damn fine work, people. Oh, God. I need to tag you. There you go. Tagged. There's a couple of gentlemen in there, it looks like. We're coming to save you, folks. Let's see if I can kneecap him. There he goes. There you go. Crisis averted. What are you dipshits firing at? Come on, Ed. All right, everyone sit tight. Keep us safe while I talk to these guys. You're safe now. Here we have Peabody Smith, carnival employee, wielding an axe. Holy shit, you're like a perfect match for uh, Morgana out there. We could have you axe people. That'd be pretty cool. You have really good pistols, too, and clubs. Man, you are crazy. Crazy awesome. You want to come with us? He's like, hell yeah. Well, I, uh... You're definitely worth coming in here for. And we have August Blackwood, who's pretty good at clubs and also good at, you know, carpenter th comp uh, carpentry things because he is a carpenter at age 42. You found my sister. Of course I'll come with you. Yep. I knew you would. Let's see what you guys got in here. Anything good? Do you have anything even to eat? What? What did I find? What? What? Oh, I must have found some pop outside. There are uh, vending machines. Are you guys finding more trouble? Come on, everybody. Let's get out of there. Yeah, it's the vending machines out here. So we could get some citrol, I guess. Kind of a bad food unit, but oh well. Hello. Did you actually get back up? Is that what happened? Get him! Let's see, what was your name again? Peabody? Take him apart, Peabody. Whoop. Did you just take some damage? No, I guess you're fine. Not sure where that blood came from, but hey. Everyone's safe and we have two new friends, bringing our total survivor count to 26, which isn't a bad amount. Usually I average about 25. And it's only the uh, 11th day, so there's plenty of time to find more survivors. All right, everyone move up. There you go. Peabody, you are a welcome addition to the team, my friend. You're going to be standing shoulder to shoulder with Morgana on the final day, I think. Protecting our gun, our Gunnersons. <laughs> Let's see if we can get some 303. We didn't find any preserves to feed our new people. But perhaps we can find some 303? Yeah. We even have a new infield, but no, we have plenty of those. We just need more stuff to feed them. Whoop. All right, uh, Virginia. What are you doing all, all the way over there? Hmm. 
Why don't you be part of the team? Also, take the citral. All right, everyone gather up. Let's keep moving down the street, see if we can find anything good. Also, someone told me I can find blessed wine in uh, churches, so we'll take a look in there. It's fairly uncommon, they stated. But we'll still take a look. Can I get some nails? Nails? Nails. I appreciate nails. Let's see if I can find any 303 in this house. I mean, they, they're both 303 houses. One's a Nails 303 house, and another one is a Preserves 303 house, but they are both 303 houses. Well, this one's just a stingy one. He gave us Nails. I guess that's enough. That is bizarre. Uh, I guess the grocer next door is actually uh, seeping in. It's corruption. You know, you're a carpenter. Have these. I should, I should have these. Also, didn't you have blunt weapons? Let's go ahead and get you a crowbar, sir. That's a blunt whoppet. There you go. Oh, and there's a goddamn graveyard. That's not too crazy next to a church, right? All right, what do we got in here? Anything good? Do we have anything at all in here other than blood and gore? Nope, it would seem we don't. That's a shame. Game is stingy. So stingy. It's all lethal. You can't have nice things. I thought we've been over this. Alright, let's go around this house and try to get in front of that sh in front of that church. I'm equipped to engage the church, so I'd like to take a look in there. Try to get some blessed wine or holy water or whatever the hell's in there. Come on, guys. Let's see. Theo and what the hell's your name? August? Theo and August made over here, no problem. Come on, kids. Here comes Virginia in third place. Oh, survivors. Come on, Ed. Ed. Okay, that got him. They come rushing towards us. They're, oh, yeah, you're over here. I forgot. I know you're dumbasses. All right, I'm probably going to go in there by myself. I have 100 pistols. I should be able to run and gun my way right in there. You need to be able to take down priority targets pretty goddamn fast. There's going to be mill zeds, police officers, just all manner of horrid things. All right, now everyone cool your heels. Cool your heels and I'll go in there. There's nothing to worry about. Let's go ahead and get a full mag. I'm probably going to need it. All right, you locked? I don't think so. All right, first target's going to be you. Or not, it'll be the wall. go see I need to tag these goddamn things whoa boy get some more let's just go oh, nope 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 drop it damn it you can't do that shit I already shot you good shooting folks oh hello I thought I heard something squishy to my left All right, where are those mill zeds? There he is. Goddamn pews. Drop it. Drop the medicals. There's someone else roaring in there. Oh, no, it's just you. Okay. And he rips that door off the hinges as he walks past it. Is there anybody else? Okay, it's a lemon head in there. I can't even get past this door. I sure hope there's something good in there. I'm not exactly sure where to look for the blessed wine or holy water or whatever, so this is a learning experience for me. I usually avoid these places like the plague, especially since my last few runs have kind of been, you know, melee runs. You appear to have fallen down, sir. Uh, I guess that's everything. I was expecting more resistance, to be honest. All right, I think if I was to look anywhere, it'd probably be in this... Uh, Podium. I was going to say pedestal? No, that's not correct. Is it... Nah, probably not a good time to look on this day. I mean, the game is in stingy mode. Hmm. No sacramental wine. Well, shoot. I was going to say, it could be on one of these pews, but hell, I don't know which one to look on. They all look pretty unimpressive. Well, that was fun. You guys trained up your rifles a little bit, I guess. I guess. 
Everyone gather up. All right, what's next on our little cavalcade here? I didn't see any gold-trimmed houses. I want my goddamn deagle game. You know I want it. Why you keep it from me? Hmm? I might have to bring all of our new friends on a new mission. They are pretty... They all are very combat-ready. I mean, what's, what's yours at? 74 clubs? That is not bad. That's far from bad. I think I rolled rolled my uh, crowbar run with 75 for the most part. Oh, these are all plain houses. All dumb houses. Damn it. Why couldn't you be a house with a gun in it? More targets. I think we've passed by here before. Just a theory concerning I see dead Zeds. Have I been in this place? No, I would have left the door open, probably. Although, no, we must have been past here before. Right? Hell, I'll just go look. No coinage, right? Also, if you see this is empty, you should look. It's kind of uh, unintuitive, but usually when it's empty, you find things. It's weird that way. All right, we have a broken down grocer. That is a hammer time. Definitely a good place to go. I could always have more 40. I require more 40 Smith & Wesson. Come on, guys. Are you guys having fun? Disengage. Do you have anything, sir? I thought I had you in short range, motherfucker. Why are you opening fire? He's all I saw him and I wanted to shoot him with my big gun. Why you gotta ruin my fun? Because I don't want you pissing off the zombies when I'm not ready for them. Alright, we'll try over there. Now, there's also houses over here, though. I guess we'll try both directions. Let's try to pick up some food from the corner store first. I see a, uh, a zombie zipping in and out of existence over there. There he is. Peg him, Theo. There you go. Good shooting there, friend. All right, let's get some nummy crunches. Nummy crunches. There we go. And we'll get some more stugets. actually jump up here with it. Alright, that's good. Jump through a window because I can. Ed, why don't you hold on to this stuff for me? There you go. Alright, is everyone cool? Everyone kosher? Alright, let's sweep right, guys. We're gonna hit the uh, sporting goods store and then we're gonna head... What the fuck are you doing in there? <laughs> you guys think you're show dogs or something? Good shooting. What the hell are you doing up there? No. Dad, Matt, get off of there. Come on, get off of there. He's going to hurt himself. No, he didn't. And then he goes through after the windows because he's a jackass. That's a window hit. That's a window hit. For a second there, I thought Theo was a zombie. <laughs> so graceful. So graceful. Oh, it's a big one. That's why they're having so, many tr so much uh, trouble. There you go. Easy as pie. Also, someone indicated you can shoot between their shoulders, the big ones. It's not always a sure thing. It's still very catchy. Or very sketchy about where the hitbox is. That's usually where I try to aim for, but I always find it a better way to just kneecap them first. Let's take the worthwhile ammo and just leave everything else. See if I can find some Z drinks. Also look for some coinage, I guess. I want some 40. It's a shame that we didn't find any. Well, the game is kind of being stingy. It probably thinks we found enough now. We found Ed and three survivors. There are key survivors. I mean, we are doing a good job. But we're pretty lucky anyway. I think that's a pawn shop over there. I got clarification on where the katana is, so I'd like to look in there again. Alright, everyone's in short range. Good. No, uh, no gold-trimmed houses yet. That's a shame. They're very easy to see. Very easy to see. Good shooting, folks. Okay, this is the proper one. This one has the 556 in it. That's how you know it's a proper katana uh, pawn shop, apparently. No 556 this time around. That will happen. 
Alright, everyone come with me. Don't you fucking go in there. If I, I've had enough of you guys jumping through windows just because I did it. They're all, we want to be awesome too, though. We can drop through windows. Alright, so if the information is correct, which I hope it is, because I'd love to find a katana back here, it should be in the tool chest or the safe. Fortunately, I think the game is pretty much going to say no. No dice. There's no katana and there's no dice. But we've got some cookies. So that's something. The kids will be happy at night. Do we have any tools? Uh, no, some duct tape. We're already good with that. You guys having fun? There you go. Oh, yeah, dear Mario jumped there. <laughs> One arm in the air, of course. Well, that's a shame. A whole bunch of jack in here. Come here. <gasps> There's something in there. There's a buffalo nickel. I can't remember what the hell that does. Uh, I think that might increase speed. Yes, it increases speed by one. Fantastic. Most, most worthless stat in the game. But I got coinage. So I'm happy. <laughs> All that matters is coinage, folks. We got a nice little park here full of friends. Go ahead and open fire. Go ahead and help you with this guy. Zoom. Ow. Good work. See, I doubt there's anything in this, but hey, it's laying in the middle of the street. Might as well check. No telling how the hell it got here, if it fell off a truck or what. Alright, plenty of targets. I was going to say, are you in long range? You are. Come on. Come on. There you go. Good shooting. There we go. Everyone's doing a good job. I tell you, those 303s are really amazing. Those Enfields, I mean. The things that launch those 303s. We should be working our way back over to the beginning here. There's a survivor house, but it's not a python house. <laughs> Regrettably. There we go. Aw. Well, it disappeared. That's good enough. I was going to say, I didn't kick into the next area code, but hey. If it disappears, I guess that's good enough. Alright, everyone can chill out here. I'm going to go take a quick look for, for a deagle house. You can go ahead and hold on to this shit. There you go. I will return shortly. You guys just sit tight, defend thyselves. And we'll see if we can't find a deagle. I could go with my guys, but I really don't need them. I have 100 pistols with everything. Except for that deagle. I'm an unstoppable killing machine. Even if the zombies are large, I can still kneecap them with this uh, 45. It's not a problem. Uh, it looks pretty cruddy over here, actually. Darn it. Well, I could find some aspirin. I think I'll try that, and then we'll head back. I need to actually take a breather. I'm about to run out of stamina. Which isn't a huge problem. It's just an inconvenience. And you guys are jackasses. You're dead, jackass. Are you going to try to zoom at me? I knew you would. And that would be your downfall. All right, we'll try for some aspirin here, and then I think we'll head back. I know it's not the best run, folks, but you're going to have to deal with it. What do we got? We got some aspirin, which is exactly what I was looking for. That'll boost our uh, first aid by 10 again. We'll go ahead and throw that on Morgana. I don't think there's anything else we want. Oh, well, there could be a tool in there. Let's see if we can find anything. I'll pop in here also. What the hell happened there? Oh, he knocked him over. I was going to say, how did I knock him over? There we go. His head's off. I should have pegged you guys when you fell down. Not really a big issue, though. Not really a big issue at all, no matter how big they are. And you are just a little lady. Even smaller now. Anything good? Any uh, granola logs? 
No granologs. Those are my favorite. They're just so healthy for you, and they're full of honey and oats. There's nothing. That, there's nothing bad about them. Wow. Well, this was a piece of shit. I really hate these places because they're usually like this. Just a whole bunch of bubkis. What about you? You have something. You have a nail gun. Well, we're gonna have to give that to another little girl, or maybe we'll give it over to you. You're a carpenter. You probably enjoy that. I think we'll head back. We got plenty of stuff. Not a whole lot of food, but we'll get that on our next run, I think. I was going to say, I didn't see any good places to get food. I think I looked there. There's a corner store. Did I go in there and get food? I think I did get food. I threw it on you, didn't I? Yeah, we did go in there. Okay, let's just head back. Not a huge issue. Try to get our new friends home. Or at least uh, get done with this mission so we can move on to the next one. All right, who needs one of these? Lil May already has one. She can only use one tool at a time. I'm gonna say, who needs one? Didn't we have, are you a thing? You're a truck driver. Eh. You know what? Henry, I think you need a nail gun, son. There you go. Good work. You're doing good work. I didn't mean to go with the fork, God damn it. I meant to go to inventory, but I guess this is a good time to get you guys situated. Might as well before I forget. Because I will forget. Open the door. Up. Up. That's the first time I've had Ben phase through shit. And I play this game a lot. So that is, uh. That is certainly interesting. That is certainly interesting. If I could just master that ability, I'd be unstoppable. Oh, look at all you little rascals. Oh, you kids. You make me so proud. All right. August. Here you go. August. I was going to say, I think that may be April right there. Go ahead and put that shit away so you don't hurt anybody. Yeah, that's April right there. I thought so. And we also have uh, Peabody Smith. Do we have any uh, other Smiths? going to say Smith, 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 Smith. Oh, there's Portia Smith. I going to say, where the hell is she? I think that's her right there. All right, well, here's Peabody. There you go. We did have another little girl I could have given a nail gun to. Oh, well. Oh, well. Now, what the hell was I doing? I was going to empty out everyone's inventory. That's right. We have some Citral. Morgana's... Actually, I need to give you this before I forget. So you should be at 100. Yes, you are. Good. And let's see. Ed has some food. We need 158 food now. Eating us out of house and home, folks. Especially since I'm not being overly, you know... Uh, I'm being lazy is what it is. Tons of antibiotics. That's all we have in there anymore. Because so I think that the healer actually has everything else. Yeah, you do. Well, you're doing a good job. How are you guys doing? You got the nail gun. I guess I could still give that to her. There you go, Portia. Sorry, Henry. Oh, you got the nails. I don't remember. Maybe I did throw those on you. Yeah, I think I said that you're the you're the carpenter, so of course I should give those to you. All right, well that's good for now. I'll go ahead and see you next time, folks, where we'll hit a gun location, probably. Which one? Well, we'll see. <laughs>